up? It's me. I am casually existing. And by casually existing, I mean I exist one way or the other. I will force myself to exist. Uh huh. What is the, the, the thing? Oh, there it is. Okay. So do that, do that, do that. There we go. Back in focus. Wahoo. So, we're playing the game we all love. Yay! We're playing War Thunder. <laughs> oh, I'm gonna go. Jeez, for once, Cheese isn't the first one here. Hi, hey, Love Pink, how you doing? Hey, guys. Jeez, we got everyone here today. Gotta love that. You know what's really funny, though? And this is just something I find funny. So, for some reason, my best fucking battles are off stream all right i don't know what it is like this game right i got seven kills this game i got seven kills for whatever the fuck reason right well most of them are unironically a lot of them are I'm trying to find where did it vanish to now? God damn it. Open folder. Maybe it's this one? I don't know. Regardless. Eyes, uh, eyes, no one needs to be as dumb. But yeah, we're just gonna play some more Thunder today. We're gonna see if anyone else wants to join in. Everyone is welcome as per our usual. Alright. I just have to remember everyone's name. <laughs> I have to remember everyone's name. That's all. Hey, Steve. It's been a while. I hope you guys are all having good days, though. Yeah, you know, what is your um, worth on your name, if you can remember? Should just appear online at some point. Ah, that's never fun, Steve. Dropping your phone in the pool is illegal in this country. We already discussed that, Steve. We are we already discussed how it's illegal to do that. Ah, fair enough. Got the challenger, 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 challenger. Ah, 5.3, I have that. Mm. Alright, Steve, well, if you come on back, you know, <laughs> I will exist, we shall exist. Uh, okay, I'll, I'll go with my... F I'm, hmm. How much do I need for the Ostwind? I need 10,000 there, alright, and then I can, yeah, 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 okay, okay, I have an idea, I have a plan, I have the plan, I'm gonna switch to my 3-3 three, three lineup here, so this is my 4-3, three. this one is my 3-3, three, three. long time no see, yeah, it has been a while, how have you been, man, jeez, it's been a little bit. Hope everything's going good. Hope your day's been great. Like, <laughs> it's been a while. Uh, 
So yeah, we can rock out with three three because that is what a lot of that's what we have a decent amount of. I'm just trying to get the Ostwin too. <laughs> ah, fair enough. I was once in high school. I feel ancient saying that, but I was, and it's something to say the least. <laughs> uh, but yeah, so. We're going to try to get the Ostwind soon, so I can then get the Ostwind 2, and then I can get the Tiger 2H and Panther G. Uh, if you're wondering what France looks like, this is what France looks like. We don't talk about how I got France, because uh, pain and suffering describes it very well. But yeah, no, uh, if you guys are ready, we're going to hop into the battle here. And we're going to see what happens. Who knows who will... I have no idea who's going to join us tonight, but we'll see who, what happens. We shall uh, see what happens. But yeah, no, uh... High school was a uh, fun, fun time. With pranks that were pulled off by my senior class. In 2020. <laughs> oh, I... I just, I'll never be able to forget that prank. We decided, hey, you know what's funny? You know, it's like, hey, you know you're really funny. <laughs> ah, fair enough. Basically, what happened is, um, my grad class in 2020, we were like, you know, what'd be really funny to do to the teachers. What if we just put a giant piece of cake on the hood of everyone's car? Right? Just a giant piece of cake on the front of everyone's car. It wasn't real cake. <laughs> it wasn't real cake, it was just fondant. We literally just made fondant cakes and put them on everyone's car. Great prank. 10 out of 10, would recommend doing it again. I'll give that prank a 10. And nice. I mean, that would be good in, with uh, realistic battles and all that. Also, Jesus Christ, I love that new monitor. Okay, okay, so I have a new monitor on the right-hand side. So where I'm looking right now well, in real life compared to everything else. It is so much faster than the old one. Holy fuck, it's a 24-inch screen as like a secondary monitor to back up my two primaries. And goddamn, like, it looks clean as fuck. I just have to move it closer, though. There we go. Now I can actually look over and see it. Me happy I get a new monitor. Also me. Time to go snipe some people. <laughs> Cause my main monitor is a twenty-eight. A twenty-eight inch, and then my secondary is twenty-four, so they're well actually no, I think this is actually a thirty-two, my bad. Thirty-two inch monitor and then you know. I ain't seen anything with Binox. Hmm. <sighs> Trying to think.
have 11 and 11, so I should have a nice split type on my shells. Hmm. The thing is, it's not the shells that are the issue right now, it's just finding the enemies to shoot at. <laughs> Am I gonna just get bombed? Oh, they're all gonna be like right near that bridge, aren't they? They're gonna be on that bridge. It's time for fun. They're gonna be on the bridge. I'm gonna go have fun with them in a stug. Motherfucker, you take my kill. You bastard. Yeah, they, yeah, they does it. They don't like this. Not much. I'm just playing War Thunder. Waiting for the enemies to say oh, hi. How are ya? Playing a stug, and I'm and I'm playing against America and Russia. And knowing how those tanks act on the US servers which I'm on the people playing them sometimes aren't the brightest like this guy for example I could have been dead but no I could have been dead there, but I wasn't because he does because I don't know what it is on the um, American servers. As this is as a Canadian, I don't know what it is, but American players tend to never look behind themselves. I mean, I don't often when I'm playing a stug because I'm more focused on things happening in front of me. But regardless, like, I could have died there because I knew there was something on that point. Like, I think I know there's something, I knew there was something up there. I just didn't know where it went. Oh, fuck me. Am I gonna have to go stug on the hill mode? I'm gonna have to go stug on the hill mode, aren't I? Yup. This is my life, apparently. Going stuck on the hill. And now I'm just gonna wait. I can I can probably just wait and angle some shots around and get some ammo back while I'm waiting. Something died over there, I'm gonna... Don't see any enemies. Ah, if you I. Okay, position yourself. Take 
that. I can take a bit of more. I can take another hit. And fire, you're dead. Reversing. Nothing there. Anything back where that guy was shot down? No. Or put down, I mean, whatever. Uh, nothing I can really see. Nothing right now, at least, but. Knowing how people play this game, I'm gonna have to wait a couple minutes before I actually fucking see things. You used to play on the European servers where they actually have a lot of skill over there, compared to the American servers. Fuck it. Don't matter, I live, bitch. I live, technically speaking. I live to the end of the match and got a kill, so haha, -ha, fuck you. Like, if I can describe every kind of War Thunder server, I'll, I'll give a brief just description of them all. So, you have... So, what you got is you have the American servers, right? American servers are the kind you go on to just to play to have fun. Uh, then you got the European servers, where it is sheer skill, everyone's gonna kill you, you're gonna get kills, everyone's gonna die at some point, etc. Basically the skilled areas. Right? And then you have the uh, Russian and South, Af South American servers. Don't really exist. You go in those, and everyone's using one type of tank only, or there's like barely anyone, so they have to pop the lobby with bots, but that is what it is. Uh, do I go to the A point like everyone, or do I just fucking... Yeah, I'm gonna go A point. I'm gonna go to the A point and cause some havoc over there. Or actually, I could go A, B, or... I don't really know. I'm just gonna spawn in near the A point and decide from there. Yeah, I'm going to the A point to cause a little bit of havoc. Germany, Russia... Not Germany, Russia. Germany, Britain, France, and Sweden versus America, Russia, Italy. We have the Swedish tanks now. What's that going to give us? That's an advantage. Gonna call artillery down that way. Because I know the enemies are gonna try to advance up on uh, this road over there and then that road over there. I know that much about them. Yeah, they're gonna be pushing through that way as well. Yeah, pretty much. All of them are going to be coming through different ways, so just watch yourself. Alright. White tank down. I think that's a long barreled 70. No, a short barrel 70. 105, I mean. I'm not gonna fucking chance this thing too hard. Pop out.
Go for the alt flank, I guess. Alternative flank. down I need to back the hell up so now, a little bit of a risky play doing that but we needed that 105 dead and we needed it dead quick do I have to repair it all no all right good Don't make overly risky plays, lads. Because that can cost you your life. Move, move, move. Love Pink, you should have moved out of my way. Hey, Michael, how you doing? Uh, mm, what do I currently have? Five kills, that's not bad. Granted, I'm playing on American servers, so it's more like two kills on European servers, so... <laughs> There's a very big difference. You, you can probably even tell the difference. Is that thing still alive? If I don't think it is. Nice. Gotta love that. One, two, three enemy air. Alright. need to lose the weight <clears throat> nice uh, I have enough for a second plane but we are gonna need a tank on we are gonna need tanks on the ground so I might just hop back in my f2 yeah I'll just hop back in my f2 and just gun it towards this area over here and get some angles on them Might be smarter to do that because might be smarter to get some more angles on them because uh you know I'm doing good. I just had thanks I just had my second Thanksgiving of the week in the span of two days, I guess. Um, you know. Was pretty happy, had fun, been doing decent in War of Thunder, been just genuinely 
having fun existing, all that kind of stuff, you know, relaxing, vibing, you know, the huge. So it's, it's been a really good time on, like, this week, to say the least. Yes, <laughs> I've been making sure everything's been going good, you know, stream-wise and my own mental stuff. Making sure everything's been going good and, you know, just genu genuinely been enjoying life. Should be able to just spawn back in and get this fucker then. Uh, yeah, this is gonna be the thing to get this guy. Mark it on the map, and then I'll, you know, Sim 22. I should be able to get it fine. It just limits me when it comes to Just don't die, you fucktards. Where's the M three that keeps on hitting uh our friendlies? You know what? I'll go down and deal with it at B point. Pretty sure there's a uh, enemy or some on B point that I can deal with. Should be able to run around and do that. I'm in a 2.7 and a 3 and a 4.0 game. <sighs> Tara B and I. I could have dealt with it myself, you dumbass. I hate people who steal your kills. You know, you're in the middle of like a thing where you can easily win, but dumbass over there has to be like, hoity fucking hoity, click, click, click. Like, bruh, you don't have to spam your mouse to get a kill. Yes. Getting closer to the dock, which then I can use to replace my JU. Modification wise, it's not gonna have anything when I get it, so it's fine. <laughs> 